Hi guys and welcome back to another episode of Let's Build Wagrindale. So today we're going to get on to a little bit of the farms and stuff like that just to try and make this this uh, kind of like hamlet type little place um, kind of fit together a little bit more. Um, so what I'm thinking is we're going to have uh, a small field for, for this guy here. He's going to have this one over there. We're going to have a couple. Mm, might not even have anything in this one actually. We might just have something like hanging up. So maybe because we were having this guy as the fisherman. Uh, so you might have some fish like hanging up outside. Um, well, actually most of them are fishermen. That guy's a fisherman. That guy's a fisherman. Um, but yeah, so we might do do something hanging out instead uh, of outside of this one. Or uh, we could have it that you know somebody that generally does like the washing and stuff like that for the, this town. Maybe lives here. I don't know. We'll, we'll kind of see how it goes. Uh, but the first thing we need to do is kind of. I'm going to continue on bits of these walls. Uh, I'm going to do it the same style as this one, so it's a bit more darker in here. So we get like this lighter bit on the, on the outside of the road with that material, and then we have a, a darker one uh, kind of going around. So I've got the brush already set up, which is quite good. So it saves us a little bit of time. Not really that much time, but just a tiny, tiny bit. Um, so I'm going to build on this. And I want to make it a little bit, probably, probably a bit lower than it has been before. Um, I think. <laughs> we'll, we'll kind of see. That's my that's my plan anyway. That's what I've got in my head. So we'll see. So if we go for we go there, these ones, and probably up there, we need to then raise. So if we do something like that, and I'm going to end up destroying most of the uh, plants and stuff that's actually on top of this. But obviously, we'll be putting out different things so we can get rid of those. Actually, no, I might actually keep. These in these bits of like different bits of dirt, kind of like we've done with the path, just to make it feel a little bit more. Uh, it kind of like adds an extra variation without us actually having to do anything, which is quite nice. So we'll just do it up to there, and maybe or I could even just leave it like that. We don't have to go um, go over the top of it. Right. So there we go. If we just do this, there we go. That's the nice plan of having brushes already done. Um, and then we can grab a couple like bits of. Have we got any slabs for these? What do we have? Oh no, we got one there. And one there. So we're just going to do a couple bits and bobs where we have some slabs on top of this. Right there and probably there. And we'll probably want to do something here. Have we got... Okay, we got that one there. Right, well let's see if we've got something for to put on top of there. We do. Cool. So we'll put this on top. Just to make it a little bit more. A little bit different, I think. Something like that will do. Right, okay, so it needs a bit more variation. Because uh, it just doesn't look quite right yet. It's not quite there. Maybe if we do that, have maybe just one of those next to it. Uh, right here, we'll do one of those on top, or maybe even switch out one of those. One up there, or there. Something like that. Something like that. Do there we go. So that just gives it a kind of like I, I quite like that anyway. I just quite like that. So I think this one needs to change for a minute. That is raised up. Can we still get up here? We can. Uh, maybe it doesn't. Maybe it just needs to be more muddy instead though. Let's do it with something like that makes makes it look better. And I think we're going to end up having something here. So we've got like a dirt gravel one. A dirt gravel one around. There it is. In terms of the layer. So that will just make that look a little bit better. So we can then walk up here, and then uh, obviously we'll go into the onto the into the field part like this. Right. Okay. So let's try out and get a brush ready. Let's grab those. Get rid of those. Um, we're probably going to use we'll use light blue or something completely different than what we've used before. All right. I'll just get rid of these plants here. Cut that back a little bit. So it's always difficult to tell with all the custom plants on it. It's really difficult to tell the actual <laughs> original structure, I think, of the of the hill. It's a bit weird. I might do as well. Let's just have on the, like, the, the higher bit there. Let's have a tiny bit of that. There's nothing else we really need then. Literally just a tiny bit. Okay. Get rid of the rest of these. The other thing with the... Um, What's it called? What's the mod called? Uh, the better, better plants and stuff or leaves or whatever it's called. I can't even remember what the 
on the actual mods called, but it's the, you know, the one that adds all these extra bits and, and like the extra grass that kind of sticks up. Actually, no, it doesn't anymore, does it? Or is that the actual... Can we in the... That might be in the, um, the mod itself. Using a... What you called it? <clears throat> yeah, I'm doing really good today. My words. Right. So I'll do something like that. That just makes a little, nice little thing there. It doesn't look too big. It's quite... Quite chilled. Right, so if we grab... What am I going to do? Probably grab another brush. So I'm we'll grab this one. And um, we'll just mask two for now and do Biosphere. So if I put on two... Uh, didn't want to do two, did we? I want to do actually three, and we'll do a smaller brush as well. It's too big, otherwise. There we go. So we should have done this beforehand because it would have got rid of the uh, the normal, some of the normal blocks. But oh well. Okay, so we'll leave those blocks in there because I, I think it'll make it look quite good and mixed. Now if we mask this, which is 35. If I can't free. Oops. Right, and now we need to come up with some nice uh, nice mix for it. And I don't actually know yet <laughs> what we're going to do. So we've got the farmland. Um, we've got quite a few different farmlands, haven't we? We've got diagonal ones as well. So I'm wondering what these are going to be like, because pretty cool. And they've got the... I really like how they've done the, uh, the 3D texture type stuff on this. Really cool. You can change the direction of it as well, so that's different. But do we want to use this? Or did we want to use a brush? I think we mix in most of that. Do you want to make it go that way as well? Round directions. We've also got the diagonal ones. Maybe. So I think we do a mix of these. So we'll have uh, that one, that one, that one, and that one's going the same way as it was, was the other one. Oh, there we go, it's done it then. So those are then going that way. Probably also want uh, dirt gravel. Dirt gravel's always good. What else do we want to put in this? Anything else? Old pods old? No, we probably don't want any of that. None of the evergreen ones. Um, mud. Thick mud. We'll try that. Is that too? No, actually, that's, that's going to work as well. Right, so we'll, we'll do this. Grab these materials. I'll probably add it to, um, to the same kind of thing that I've done before. So I've got tool info. There, 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 there and there. Right. And then we need to do a biosphere of 1388, come on, 12. Uh, 1388, come on. 0. Three, oh, 1388. I did 1288 then. That might come up with some weird results. So, 0. 3888, come on. 1. 1388, come on. 13. 1374, come on. 7. Right, okay. I'll try this out. That doesn't look too bad. It's a little bit too heavy on the mud um, and the dirt gravel. So that's the only problem with that. Let's just undo that. I'll get that in a bit. Uh, right. We do those two. Okay, because I've already put down that there. So we need to switch out that. There, so let's get these a little bit better. So it's whether we actually cut out those two for the time being and leave it like that and then end up... Because we've already got natural bits in here anyway. It might be that we don't actually need to do anything with it. Because that to me looks pretty good. As I farmed ground, I think. Another thing I might want to do is definitely add in some of that. Thick mud as like a as like the gen, you know general one. So I'm going to do that quickly. I will just take out the other one. What do we have before? There we go. That one there. Thick mud's the last one. 
cut that down. Try that. There you go, that looks a little bit better, I think. I think that does anyway, and I might just switch out a couple of these. That one. That one, that one. And probably that one as well. So that looks a lot better, I think. There you go, okay, so that's that. What do we want to put in here? So we've got loads of food stuffs now, absolutely tons. Uh, all the way from melons. What else we got? We've got. I'm sure we've got cabbages somewhere. I'm sure I've seen cabbage. I am sure of it. But maybe I'm imagining it. There you go, look. Cabbage. So we've got that. Uh, it might be under plants instead, that's why. Uh -huh. Yeah, so there we go. We've got cabbage, corn, and wheat. Uh, small wheat, mature wheat. Tobacco as well, okay. <laughs> Didn't know that one was in there. Um, Goddamn tons, haven't we? I think we've got legumes as well. Uh, jungle fern. Where's the legumes? Turnips. Ooh, yeah, we'll do some turnips. So maybe we'll do cabbage and turnips. We've got pole beans, beans, legumes. There we go, there they are. So most of them are all over in this bit, I think. So I have some of these down. They're quite green, aren't they? But I have a couple of these. Like randomly grown in. I'm gonna do it a bit random, I think. That's what I'm gonna end up doing. It's either that or do we want to structure it a little bit? We might want to structure it. It's either that or we use the uh, player head still. If we want to do that, I might have to find them again. Because there was so, so the conquest uh, player heads, isn't there? Because they're very good. But I think, yeah, let's structure this a little bit better. Let's have the. I'll try these ones out and see what you guys think. And then actually, yeah, if you guys comment if you want, I want to use the other ones instead. That'd be cool. We'll see. If we want to use the player heads instead. Because I do quite like the player heads. They are, they are pretty damn good. There you go. And this go all the way in like that. There you go. Get some little bits and bobs. And we probably also want to put in some normal grass as well. Uh, just to make it look... Like there's a couple spots where it's overgrown or you know they haven't picked out weeds you know all that kind of stuff oops I don't want to do that up there maybe one there and one there so I'm putting some probably want to put in some plants around here as well that looks good right let's do this other wall so we're probably gonna have right where well, we're gonna have the entrance to this this is gonna have to connect up to here this is gonna be the bigger field out of the, out of the two obviously so I have this one here, we'll probably have another field uh, lower down here, maybe we'll do like a small thing, or we'll do like a well or something. Um, I think I'm going to do a stream, I think I've decided finally, uh, that over on this section, that I'm going to flood this a bit, not not like masses, uh, I'm going to flood it, have like a weird little cavey thing here uh, that goes down, and then uh, we'll have a stream go all the way down here, uh, kind of weave its way around, we'll do something with the path as well. And I'm going to have it come down this way. So it's going to, just going to be a really, really small stream. So that's where we're going to, going to get the water from. So maybe we'll do some like buckets around with, with water. So it's like they've carried it or something. Uh, to try and make it look kind of good. So that'll be quite cool, I think. That's a good idea. From, I think. I think it is anyway. We'll see. Right, so if we do the same kind of thing around here, we'll probably end up filling up that one. Um, this needs to be up there. I want to have a bit of grass on the side as well. So I can put stuff in it. I'll probably end up... If we cut this corner, right? If we cut it quite sharply, we can then put something like a tree there. You know, something like that, just to cover up how green that is. <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> Do something like that. Or, or, or put bits and bobs around, I don't know. We'll, we'll kind of see. Okay, and then we could... I think if we just link it all the way up to this wall, really. We'll, we'll figure out the entrance in a bit. Go right here, right to there. Have that on top like that, and that'll do. And then if we switch out all these blocks for grass, so we get the little field down here like that. Okay, so let's try try that. Let's just paste this in. There we go. 
like that. And where are we going to have the entrance for this? Um, probably we'll have it over here. We'll have something like that there. Grab the same stones. Put those on top. We're also going to grab the two slabs, I think. And we'll do some small stone. We'll also grab the big blocks as well, so we can kind of vary this a tiny bit, because at the minute it's, it's a bit boring. Um, put like something like that on there. That one go to there. That one there, maybe. And then that one there. And maybe we can have this one go up to there. That. And there, there, and then that should start to kind of like warp it all together. Look okay, and it does look okay. Looks fine. So yeah, we'll, we'll shove a tree in there. Um, need to extend the path a bit of this into here, but then again, we can actually just use uh, whatever we want really on that bit. So let's grab this. Uh, grab this one here. Just do a mask two and BR sphere or thirty-five color three. Probably do it quite small again. Just to keep this in. I'll try and get that one to there. There we go. So let's do something like this. I won't go all the way up the hill because it doesn't really make much sense. I'm also going to leave this little gap here for something like uh, maybe a little storage, you know, place, you know, where they where they store up all their all the goods. Do something like that. Okay. Get all this in. Eventually. What we really need to do is get the ID for um that forest floor one. I've got quite a bit of it around here. Quite a bit more than I thought I did. So there we go. That will do for that. Let's get rid of these plants then. This is a bit easier, I think. I don't know what I'm going to put in this. I think I might go with like uh, wheat or something like that rather than anything else. I mean, we'll do something, do something simple. I'm going to leave that one there because that one I think works. That needs to be switched out. Um, these ones will do fine. Now, what ID, just out of interest, is that one? Because I think we do need to switch it. So that is. Well, we'll also mask that one then. So we've got mask two and one three seven two column one. Let's do that. There we go, that's gonna end up hitting a lot more than it was before. A lot lot more, so that will work, I think. Quite nicely. There we go. That's better. That has reduced it loads. That means we won't be knocking out as much uh, tall grass and all that kind of stuff. So I think what we're going to do next episode as well is we're going to move over onto that side, um, do the little kind of stables, and um, probably finish off that field. Then we'll have a look at the rest of the town. It might be that we're very, very close to being done. Uh, it depends on how much more I think we can add to it and and what we actually need to add to it as well. Um, obviously, we need a little bit of a dock for the for the fishermen. We do need to do that. So that's that's kind of like one of the things on my list to do. Um, but I want to finish off that little stream going down there, so it's whether we end up switching to a completely different series <laughs> for like a couple episodes to do that. Um, I still can't remember what it's called in, in Skyrim anyway, uh, that little area. But we'll do one of those. <laughs> that's what that's the plan. Build one of those things, um, and then bring that down. Like bring the bring the stream down, and then if we got the stream down, we can then get the beach all done, and then we'll we'll decide on on what we want to do. Uh, how we want to tie that in, but it'd be ideal to have the the kind of like beach bits I've been doing finish for it, because then you don't have to tweak as much, or it's already there, or you know all that kind of stuff makes more sense to me. Right, okay, so we're nearly. I'm gonna need a brush to get rid of this stuff. <laughs> so I might I might end up spending the time going through all the material, all the all the different grasses I've got on top of this, to then brush those out. 
that would work. Right, so let's sort out this hill. At the minute it's a bit rubbish. Um, this bit here is just randomly steep, so we'll, that just randomly goes up, really, or, or around this corner. So we will cut that back a bit. Like that. Put in a bit of those. I don't actually too mind, mind too much about the mud. It's quite good. Good to have it ran, like, randomly in. There's a couple of those that we need to change, but we might just change those. Have we brushed it? How does that look then? So that's a little bit better as a hill. Uh, we can maybe even bring it out here as well. So, uh, this bit's a bit weird, so we'll end up doing something like that. But that's alright. It's not too bad. I'm not too worried, worried about the top. I don't really like this one here. Just don't have it with that then. That will do. Right, okay, let's let's brush this in. Let's see what it looks like. A bit random, but kinda good. Randomly ploughed. <laughs> really randomly ploughed. There's patterns, so I'm not too sure. Some of them look really, really patterned actually with this. So I might need to I might need to adjust this this brush. In the end, like you get these like weird like these two here, the, the two straight ones, and then you just get like almost like a corner. It's really weird how that's turned out. Uh, there you go. So this is quite strong on green stuff. Can you even see that one? There you go. All right, okay. Try to reduce it so that it doesn't look as strong. Uh, I still want little bits and bobs of um, like little. Every so often, uh, you get like bits of the screen, just not as much as there is at the minute. I want to make it look like they have actually worked the ground rather at the minute because of these bits it looks like they they haven't which isn't so good okay let's try that then so if that's reduced it a little bit better yeah that's a lot better than it was still too messy I think it needs more more dirt really more of that mud like that kind of stuff um, we'll see All right, let's get rid of those two I'll keep that one in the no, we'll get rid of the one in the middle. Actually, three in a row, that's weird. Get rid of that one. And these don't, I'm not too worried about at the side. Two here, let's get rid of that one. And here looks a bit weird. Get rid of those. And obviously, I've missed a bit of grass there. Get that one there. And that, I think it's alright now. Okay. Let's go around this edge now and sort this out. If we want to put a bit more there, or there, and then obviously mud would catch down onto these bits here. There we go. Right. So what do we want to do with the within this field? What, what do we actually want to put up? Oh, we got lots, lots to choose from: flax, water mint, vines. Now we don't want any of those. None of those. Barley. Barley might be interesting. Uh, we've got mature wheat. We've got small wheat. Let's get rid of these. <laughs> small wheat. Right, let's go. Barley. Mature wheat. Small wheat. Uh, wheat. Corn. Legumes and beans and pole beans and all that kind of stuff. Uh, fodder layer and dry fodder layer. Wow, it's all just nuts. Let's try a couple of these out and just see what they look like. So that one is, that one's barley, this one is small wheat, so small wheat can grow, okay, so we can do two high of that one, um, whoops, let's put that down, back again, right, that one, do that behind there as well, uh, we've got wheat, which wheat is just, just like that, so that's pretty good as well, should we have mature wheat, did I just completely skip over this, didn't I, mature wheat, yeah I did, so mature wheat's pretty good as well, and you just have one high of that, um, and that's wheat, that's corn, obviously, and corn we can we can grow. But I can't imagine them having a lot of corn here. So I think we're going to go with... Barley, small wheat. I might go with just these two. And leave those ones. So I'll just have a mix between these these three, maybe? I don't know, does this one look okay? I think it does. Um, I was just thinking about these two. So you got green as well. Now that is turning into, ah, that's because that's turning into grass, the dirt is turning into grass, aha. Uh -huh. 
was wondering where the grass was coming from because I'm sure I had it all. Right, so that's fine. So if we go scale this all back, um, we're going to still keep those two tools. Let's grab, grab a new tool. <laughs> and we're going to just end up doing like uh, BR Sphere. No, not BR Sphere. Mask. If I come on one, for example. I'm going to end up masking this, I think. And we'll do some random bits around. Maybe. I don't know. Is that going to mess up this? Because it's not. Both of these custom ones now. Farmland. Farmland as well. Okay, so that's. All of these are custom. So that's quite good. It means that. that uh, like, if we put it on top of grass, you know, when it disappears, it won't do that, which is really good. So, mass those two. Um, I'll mass that one. And we'll do tool info. Ah, this isn't going to work because of this. That's true. Because of the, the double height ones. So, maybe we're going to have to do it by hand. Um, that's fine. It's not a problem. Right. So, small wheat. Let's just randomly go around with this because we can just put this one wherever we want. Anywhere at all. Oh, that is the double one. Ah. <laughs> okay, randomly put this one up double as well. That's fine. Not, this. Not that one down. I don't like that. There we go. I'll do. Okay, uh, there. A couple of these. Make them double. Does it go up even higher? No, it doesn't. That's fine. <laughs> wasn't expecting it to. I was just wondering if it did. It could go up infinitely high. You could have, like, super wheat. Or something, I don't know. Would be very odd, but <laughs> you never know. Right, so barley, let's put some of that in as well. That one is just single high. Okay. Let's get these in, because it just looks... The reason I've used barley is because it looks quite... Um, looks a bit greener. So it doesn't look as kind of like fully, you know, ready to harvest or whatever. It just looks just slightly off, but it doesn't look too doesn't look too uh, green. So it looks like it's brand new, whereas some of the other ones did. Uh, I didn't want to really do that, especially with with this. I don't want to have, you know, I wanted to, have, you know, they just pretty much grow it. They they can't really do crop rotation, so they have to obviously buy buy some stuff too. Uh, but the good news is they're pretty near the capital, so they could actually go into town and get a cart of food and bring it back. Um, but where does the capital get the food from? That's the question. I think we're going to have to do some farms, like proper farms. Um, across, especially across the mountains. The other side of the mountains are pretty pretty open, so we can actually do that, which would be quite nice. So we'll do some, do some actual farmland and, you know, just have uh, the main road and it just goes past like, the farm, farm, farmland and farmhouses and stuff. Um, that would be quite interesting. Do and it'd be quite easy as well, um, especially if you get your brushes right. Just did when I when I did the, the Hobbit series, especially you know that I think I got the brushes right for it. I'm just gonna knock down that, put in that, put in Valley there. All right, we're gonna do some more double high ones. Just put in some gaps around here, here, here. Put one down there. That's looking better. I'm mean, a bit thicker around here now, which is good. So maybe we'll finish off this bit. Use that as like a, you know, like a starting point, really. But I don't want to make it look like it's got, you know, it's like not really, really lush field. It's more, uh, this is just about what they've been able to grow. <laughs> not much else. So I don't want to make them feel like they've got an abundance of food. So they've just about got enough. Or maybe not enough. And that's why they're disgruntled. Maybe we could have some disgruntled disgruntled peasants are always fun. So you have some of those around. There you go. So pretty much they have pretty limited diet, <laughs> if you think about it, because they've got uh, you know they've they've got some uh, fishermen, so they're gonna have fish coming in. Quite a lot of fish. I mean, most of their diet. Um They've got some wheat and they've got some cabbage. Uh, what else they got? They got uh, parsnips as well. They got some vegetables at least. Not just a <laughs> fish diet, which would be quite insane. Right, here we go. That's good. That's looking a lot better. 
I was just not looking for good from some angles. But I think that's partly the lighting. I always, always kind of like puts you off. You have to get it right. If you get it like here, it's fine. Um, there we go. And probably no one there. Yeah. That'll do. That's pretty good, doesn't it? Doesn't look too bad. Just need a little bit more. And some choice places. Oh, that's pretty good now. I think we're done with that field, which is looking good now. Yeah, like that. I like that. Right, let's do. I want to get a brush out, which I was thinking, which is pretty stupid, really. Get a brush out just for this. Let's grab a couple of these um, and mix them in. That one, there we go. Dirt gravel, for example. Whack that in there. That'll do. It's like a little entrance. Um, the only thing I've done stupidly is put that up there, which is really weird. So that'll do there. Let's get some more like farming tools. Um, I'll probably do that. We go farming tools. Spot on. We'll put that up here. Something you know, have them against the wall. Maybe up against here. Maybe even over here. I put them there. Uh, what else they got? Those are all the weapons racks. We don't want those. I don't need pistols, don't need any spears, don't know why we would. <laughs> don't need a bow or anything like that. Uh, small farming tools, we have some of those. Already got the big ones. And have we got a sickle or something? There we go, a sickle. I'll shove a sickle down randomly in there. I might also get some like baskets. There we go, basket. Empty light wicker basket, wow. Looks like a basket slab, I didn't know about these. These are quite cool. So we'll get some of those, and we'll also get a whisk wicker basket with its top on as well. So something like that, which I quite like. So we'll have these for like uh, collecting in the fields or whatever. You know, maybe, maybe they'd have those. I don't know. It's just to add in something different, I guess. And I can let them up and, and go. Got some random sickles around as well. <laughs> there we go. Got that. What about the small farming tools? Do we want to do anything with these? So we've got some there. Maybe we'll have some there. I'll just have them at the entrance. Uh, and then we could do with some wheat. So we've not got that, but we have got thatch, haven't we? Yeah. Let's do a little thatch pile around. Probably around. Do it around here. A little thatch pile. Just something simple. Got a slab? We have got a slab. Excellent. And we got a vertical one as well. I should have that on the side. Like that. There we go. Like that. This, I'm sure, it's carpet, isn't there? Or is it not called that? Is it called like straw or something? Hey, there we go, hay, okay. Hay bale and hay, okay, that's fine. Right, let's do that. Probably do need that one. We don't really need that though. So let's just get rid of that. And uh, then we'll have some straw as well. Oh, hay on the ground. Just around it. Oops. It's not down there. Don't need the empty one. I could probably do with making that a bit more messy. There you go, small little pile. That will shove in a tree here at some point. Uh, just to make it feel a little bit more welcoming, I guess. Uh, yeah, it's not too bad though. It's looking good. It's getting there. What else do we want to put around? Oh, yeah. Like a basket. A closed one. Hay in there. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know why they would do that. Maybe it doesn't make sense with these baskets. I was just thinking they could collect it up into something and then go. But they probably wouldn't, would they? Yes, yeah, so let's get rid of those. They don't don't need those. That's ridiculous. So let's get rid of those. But they could actually do with them in the other field. So we'll get we'll put one in the other field. We don't really need too many of them. Let's just do that. There we go. One in here. They can collect it all up and stuff. Shove it in there. And job done. Right. So that's pretty good. I'm pretty happy with that. Quite nicely tailors off, and because we've got the trees as well, it doesn't look too bad. I think it looks all right. Pretty happy with that. 
So what I need to do off camera is I need to build up this this side here so that it actually goes off uh, onto that path. Even if it just goes onto that path, it'll just make it look a lot nicer. Because uh, at the minute it looks a little bit too... It doesn't quite work. Um, I'm pretty happy with that. Um, what we'll also do, guys, is... Well, next episode what we'll do is we'll, we'll get onto the uh, stables for this. Now, I've cut down, cut back the hill I think did last time, like a tiny little bit around here, so we can actually whip this around here, and then we'll have the stables up here or something. Um, and then just bring that grass around, and maybe we'll do another little field or something here, uh, down on this bit. But I think we'll have the wall go around, well, we will have the wall go around here, rather. So we'll have, we'll have like, a bit of green there, uh, even if it's just filled with stuff, but that looks pretty good. It looks a little bit better. Uh, and we're getting there. And we can also need to do the outside of these houses and get some little bits of detail along that bit. It's starting to all come together. Anyway, guys, hopefully you've enjoyed it. If you have, comment, like, subscribe, and I'll see you guys on the next one.